G'day everyone, my name is Daniel O'Grady and welcome to another Wasabi Cars video. Thank you so much for joining me for what will be the last video from Nagoya, at least for a while. And by Nagoya, I mean the Toyota Automobile Museum, the Mitsubishi Auto Gallery and Rocky Auto. Yes, there's so much more footage from these three places, but I want to get back to car spotting and the car show videos. So uh, this is the last one for a while at least. Now the car is a car that I've been wanting to see <laughs> For so long I was so happy to see it at the Mitsubishi Auto Gallery. Now it says here on this bit of plastic it's a 1974 Mitsubishi Lancer 1600 GSR and uh, I would like to point out a couple of things. Nitpicky perhaps but uh, the placard in front of the car says 1973. Bam! And uh, both say that this is a GSR. Now the GSR I believe was a sporty two-door now it had the same engine, it had that uh, 1600cc single overhead cam engine, twin carbs, um, but you know this isn't a two door and it doesn't have a GSR badge. Now I also did read that um, a fella who is very important to our story, his name is Yoginda Singh, uh, a Kenyan native, super successful rally car driver in East Africa and uh, he won the grueling East African Rally on three occasions. The first one was 1965. He won that with his brother in a Volvo. And then in 1974, this is the car that he won the race in. Now he also won again in 76. Uh, that car was number eight. But I believe it's the same car. But anyway, as it sits in the Mitsubishi Auto Gallery, um, it does represent the 74 winner. And I'm not entirely sure why that is. Maybe that was the one that meant the most to the company. I guess it certainly established Mitsubishi and Lancer, you know, as a, as a, you know, as, as a successful rally car and a durable car. So maybe that was the most important one. So just run your eye over it, guys. It's got that blacked out hood, stunning red stripe. Well, <laughs> I think I'm making things up. But um, yeah, it's, you know, of course, rally spec, it's got the, the spotlights, it's got um, those rubber flaps, you know, it's, it's almost like a front spoiler-like rubber flaps, which, uh, I, you know, I'm not sure of the science or the mechanics of it, but um, I'm sure it does a good job at whatever it does. And um, yeah, it's, a, it's in fantastic condition, I can only assume it's been restored. Now, there's a bit of artwork on the wall at the Mitsubishi Auto Gallery, check it out. It's a nice uh, watercolour. Yeah, and you can see it's a beautiful scene, and it does look fantastic. Okay guys, just before I go, I would like to share with you, because I can, the uh, Lancer 1400 GL. It's of course in the same museum, and it is the garden variety version. Uh, super clean, same colour, I mean, it's almost, well, the same car as that GSR, which is not really a GSR, so they are the same car. Wow. Okay, oh, before I go, um, do you want me to, to mix it back up again or do you want to see more cars from the Toyota Museum, the Mitsubishi Auto Gallery, Rocky, Rocky Auto? Do you want to see more or do you want to get back to some variety? Please let me know in the comments below. Much appreciated. Time for me to go guys. Take it easy. See you.